Gemma Atkinson revealed that her C-section scar began throbbing after a short walk, prompting her to realize that she needs to slow down while her body adjusts after the physical stress of birth. We popped, Tiago, in the car, my mom drove us, and I carried him in his car seat, then after that we walked for about 15 minutes and just that on its own has set my scar off throbbing a bit, the 38-year-old winced on Instagram. I feel a bit, not sick, but, a bit up. It's just a constant reminder of what your body's been through if you've had a c-section and just to slow down. Gemma acknowledged that she hadn't expected things to be plain sailing but the fitness model is so accustomed to regular physical activity that she didn't initially realize she'd gone too far. In fact, she admitted her mum Sandra had told her not to lift the car seat by herself, but she'd been stubborn and done it anyway. Read now, Gary Lineker hits out a Stuart Broad's fairy tale ending to career mocked, latest, meanwhile, the former Hollyoaks actress turned fitness influencer has made it clear she has no regrets about welcoming baby number two as she says she hasn't shared out her love, but multiplied it. It's been almost three weeks since little Tiago first arrived into the world, and by next week she hopes to have healed enough to be gently walking her beloved spaniels again. Meanwhile, anything that Gemma has lacked in physical activity, she has made up for an Instagram Q&A interaction, enthusiastically answering fans' questions in detail. As some of her 1.9 million followers quizzed her about the birth, she revealed, Physically I'm sore, although I expect to be, but mentally I feel really good. Don't miss! Sinead O'Connor's cause of death update given by coroner, latest, Harry and Meghan slammed by Piers Morgan's wife for violating Hollywood code, debate, antiques roadshow star back at work after being told she has year or two left health, even with broken sleep, am happy and come and that for me is a biggie. She breastfed for both of her children and has found it a calm experience, joking that she was milk drunk as she cuddled with her baby boy after a feed. However, she's insisted that women should feel no guilt if they are unable or unwilling to feed that way, suggesting, it should be a personal choice. She added, there's nothing worse than being pressured into thinking you have to do something, when at the same time, it's so hard for many women. One mom asked curiously, were you worried how you could love another child as much as Mia? It scares me. Gemma candidly replied, for a brief time when I first found out I was pregnant it did, but it's actually the complete opposite. The love isn't shared, it's multiplied. The star, who will appear with partner Gorka Marquez in a forthcoming TV show detailing her pre- and post-birth experiences, has also shared why she opted for a C-section, and admitted she had little choice. My first option of vaginal birth wasn't possible due to my waters breaking over 24 hours earlier and Tiago opened his bowels also. The choices on the day were a c-section or artificial hormone induction. Had the hormone with Mia and hated it so didn't want that again, so happily went for the section and it was such a wonderful experience, she marveled.